today we are going to start a new topic insects i have many insects who came to visit us today the first one is ladybug ladybug is a rat it has spots on her body how many spots does this ladybug have let's count one two three four five six seven eight ladybug has eight spots let's repeat all together three times ladybug 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 next we have a little snail snail is very very slow insect what color is our snail it is green and it has pink shell let's repeat now this insect snail 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 next i have a little bee bee can fly what color is our bee it is yellow and black it has stripes yellow and black stripes what does the bee say the bee says buzz buzz next i have a little spider spider has how many legs does the spider have let's count one two three four five six seven eight spider has eight legs let's repeat all together spider 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 next i have a little ant ants are very little insects but they are very strong and hard working insects what color is our ant it is brown let's repeat ant three times and 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 next insect which i have is a dragonfly dragonfly also can fly fly like a bee for example what color is our dragonfly it is blue let's repeat three times dragonfly 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 Next, is, next insect which I have is it will be a grasshopper. What color is grasshopper? It is green. Grasshopper has very strong legs because he hops in the grass. Hop, hop, hop. Let's repeat together. Grasshopper, grasshopper grasshopper next i have a caterpillar caterpillar is green it crawls crawls and then it turns into a beautiful butterfly what color is our butterfly it is orange yellow and it has pink spots butterfly also can fly from flower to flower now let's repeat these two insects caterpillar 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 and butterfly 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 and the last insect which i have for you today is a lightning bug lightning bug makes light see it makes light at night these are little bugs which you can see at night let's repeat together lightning bug lightning bug lightning bug thank you for your attention we miss you very much hello guys uh, continue learning insects and let's do some tasks first we are going to do who knows what is it what it is it is a ladybug you need a tusk and scissors. First, we need to cut out all these shapes. I'll do it with you. Uh, 
our ladybug is red and black. So, now I'm finishing. I hope you are finishing too. Here we go. First, uh, the first shape which I have is a circle. We take a glue stick and now we need to find where shall we stick our circle on our ladybug. I found, here it is, I'm gluing and sticking circle. That's what you have to do. First, then this shape is a square, red square. Now I'm going to stick it through. Here we go. Square, red square and black circle. Next shape which I'm going to take is a triangle. Three quarters, three angles, triangle. It's in the middle. Next is oval, black oval, we should stick on the head of our ladybug in the middle. And the last is rectangle, red rectangle on the left. Here is our ladybug, it is ready. Let's repeat one more time. Circle, square, triangle, rectangle and oval. Ladybug. Ladybug has six legs. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ladybug. Next task, we are going to repeat colors and we will color the insects. Before this, let's repeat the colors. First, orange, blue, brown, yellow, light green, Black, peach, green, pink, red, light blue, and purple. The first color which we need is purple. <clears throat> we need to color snail with purple color. Look attentively at all the insects we have here and find a snail. Mm -hmm. Is it a snail? No, it's not. It's a butterfly. Here is snail. Snail. Let's color its shell with purple. I'm not very good at coloring as you are. But I will try. is purple. Next color which we need is red. Here it is. And with red we need to color ladybug. Ladybug. Ladybug is red and it has black spots. See? Black spots. Red with black spots. Ladybug. Next, we need green. This is green, this is light green. We need green. With green, we will color caterpillar. Where is caterpillar? Here it is, caterpillar. Green. Green caterpillar. Caterpillar. Next, we need yellow. How do you think? What insect can be yellow? Maybe butterfly? Maybe. But we have bee. Bee is yellow and black. So we need to color stripes. One stripe is yellow, one stripe is black. So if you want, you can color these stripes black. 
Next color which we need is pink. Pink is for butterfly. Here is our butterfly. Color is pink. As you want. You can color all butterfly pink. Or you can choose other colors to make it more colorful. You can, these are butterflies' wings. And you can color her body, spots with different colors. The main thing to use pink. Next is brown. How do you think? What insect is brown? We have left only one. It's worm. I'm a wriggly worm. Brown. Worm. Worms live usually under the ground. You can see them after the rain. Brown worm. And the last color which we have is orange. But orange we will use not for the insect but for flower. Flower is orange. Orange flower. Do you know what, uh, what insects like to sit in the flower? Bees and butterflies, they sit on the flower. That's all, we finished our task. Thank you. Okay guys, next task we're going to do is puzzle with insects. You need a task and scissors. First, we need to cut out our puzzle. First, we're cutting it outside and, and then cut out each stripe. Be careful with scissors, don't cut your fingers. Do it slowly and carefully. Each number. Number two. Here it is. Two. Number two. Look attentively at your stripes and find number two. Now glue next to the number one and stick the stripe with number two close to each other because we need to make a picture. After number two, we have number three. Number three. If you can find it without my help, that's great. Not number three. Glue next to number two and stick stripe with number three. Close to number two. Here we go. Up to number three goes number one, two, three, four. Number four. Did you find it? Here it is. Number four. Find it. Glue and stick. Number four. After number four goes one, two, three, four, five. Number five. Ready? Here it is. Number five. Glue and stick. Close to number four. Make it beautiful. Don't hurry. After five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Number six. Here it is. Don't mix it with number nine. Six. Glue and stick. Oop. Six. 
Next, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Number seven, are you ready? Glue stick, number seven. See, we're almost finishing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's more difficult, eight. Put it straight, not like me. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Glue, stick, and the last number, ten. You have left glue and stick. Here is our picture. Is ready? Now let's see what insects we have in our picture. We have here snail. How many snails do we have? One, two, three. Three snails. Let's find where snail is. Here it is, little slow snail. Snail is pink and green. Snail. Next, we have here spiders. Where is spider? Let's see. Where is our spider? Here it is. Little spider with eight legs. Spider. Next, we have dragonfly. Very beautiful dragonfly. Where is our dragonfly? Hmm? Here it is. Dragonfly. Dragonfly can fly. It has wings, so it can fly. Because spider and the snail, they can't fly. And last we have ant. Ant. How many ants do we have? One, two, three. Three ants. Here is our ant. Ant. And we have one more here. Who did we miss? We have worms. Where is my worm? Here it is. Wriggly worm, 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 worm. Let's repeat all together. Worm. That's all. Thank you.